I set up Japanese Pokemon cards, X Pokemon cards, and three mystery Pokemon cards. I set them in rows. This is a Heatran level X with its moves are Heat Metal and Heat Wave. Whatever you like the most by telling me comment. A signed Mew EX by a person who won it in, in a contest signed it. And a Japanese Aerodactyl. It's shiny. And a, a level 28. A Torterra X. Uh, I don't know them. A Furious Dash and Forest Marmors or something. It does 100 damage and it's a level X and it has a 160 HP. This is a Palkia X Hydro Refra Reflect and something else, 120 HP, and it does 60 damage. And a Porygon Z. Try attack and converge, uh, whatever. And it does 40 times damage. This is a Regigigas X. It has Sacrificer and Giga Blaster, 100 damage. It and it has 150 HP. And in Polion X, it has 140 HP. Hydro Impact, its weakness is electric. A Infer an Infernape X, 120 HP, Burning Head, Flare Up, 150. I mean 120 HP and 150 damage. Its weakness is water. A Japanese Tangela, it only has 50 HP, it's a level 8, and it does 20 damage. Its weakness is fire. Japanese, I forget what the name is, and it has 40 HP. Is that a nine tails? Yes, a nine tails. No, wait, sorry, it's not a nine tails. It has 40 HP, a level 10, it does 20 and 10 plus damage. Can you identify that card? It's a Vulpix. It's a Vulpix. Its weakness is water. Sorry. A Japanese Totodile. A level 13, 40 HP, it does 10 and 10 plus damage. If you know what star um, in the corner is, please comment me. And 
just one more. A pro boss pass. Metal bar <coughs> bomber and steel coating. Level 46, 90 HP, it does 60 damage, its weakness is water. Thank you for what thank you for watching the videos and bye bye